men of the RAF parachute training establishment at Abingdon are perfecting an item in the next Farnborough air display. Delayed action dropping onto a target. Nearby, the dropping zone officer had that target well marked out and indicated, so as to be visible from 12,000 feet. Meanwhile, in their Argosy aircraft were the paratroops, to whom this precision landing is all part of a day's work. It's a good notion of the RAF to let the general public at Farnborough see it being done. The Argosy was now at operational altitude. And though there was plenty of cloud, it wasn't too much to hide the target. All you have to do in parachuting is to walk out of the aeroplane. They were at 12,000 feet and had to fall for 2,000 before pulling the ripcord to open the chute. To anyone who's never done it, parachuting seems about the greatest manifestation of faith possible in this life. You never hear of failure. All the same, it takes nerve to drop from an aircraft, trusting that that thing on your back will do its stuff. There's a lot more to this exercise than just falling. The parachute has to be guided down onto the target area, which seems very small indeed from 12,000 feet. In real war, it's essential to be able to land just where you want. Even for the expert, it's a nice feeling at the end of it to be all in one piece.